Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is the flip side. And if I sound very excited, that is because I just got back from my senior trip. I it was I went to Washington D.C. with my class for three days. I had so much fun. Like I've been having a lot of really bad shit going on in my life lately, and I just needed to have fun. And my God, that was some of the best fun I've had in my whole life. I just got back home. I in my room, my computer, my bed, my bed. But let me tell you, those last three days when I couldn't record something for you guys was killing me. I felt even worse because I missed uploading Mega Man Unlimited, which is why tomorrow you're getting two episodes. But for now, oh my god, I'm so excited. SCP Contain Breach version 1.1 just came out today, and I am so happy. I've been waiting months for this. I know that it's been ready since... Gallus has said that it's been ready for a few months. He was waiting for Containment Breach Run, but he decided to release them separately. And like I said, Containment Breach Run, I will be doing a live reaction video with a face cam. And I got home, and turns out we're already up to version 1.1.3. There have been three patches since I last checked. And let me tell you, a six-hour drive from Washington, D.C. to New York City... Especially Brooklyn, meaning you have to cross Ver uh, Staten Island. If you know what that's like, I feel bad for you. And it really doesn't number on me. I think the traffic made it like seven hours. I was locked up in that bus. I was going freaking nuts. But I am finally home. I'm so happy. And those three days when I couldn't record, I was going nuts. And I'm so happy I could finally record for you guys. And it's just perfect because 1.1.3 just came 1.1 1 .1 just came out today. And I don't, I know it's, oh, and here's my old one, 1.0.6. 1. Here's the mod I've been making, XK Class, Box of Fours, and 1.1.3. 1. Now, before we start up 1.1.3, 1. 1. I need to do two things. What is this? This is new. I don't care, run it. What is this? I haven't seen this before. Oh, I'll figure it out later. It's not important, clearly. And everything else. Light map. P what is this? There's so much new stuff. Okay, I'm going to have to figure this out. Okay, there's the readme. I'm assuming that's. Yeah, that's just the stuff. Options. Oh, crap. <laughs> Alright, then, uh, source code. Change list. Here it is. Okay. Some additions in the box four is mod. One seven eight ten seventy four. I was looking forward to that one. And eleven twenty three. That's the skull. The skull, the painting, and the glasses. New rooms. Night vision goggles. Yes, we have night vision goggles finally. Oh, I'm I'm very excited for the night vision goggles that you put on either fine or very fine. Yes. Clipboard. You get a clipboard. Achievement menu. There's an achievement menu from Goodbye. New difficult. Safe, basically the same as the old Euclid. Euclid, you can only save at computer and security monitors. Permadeath and more aggressive SCPs. Highest priority to summon and chase the player more actively instead of water. Custom? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> oh my god. A new room in the pocket dimension replaces the room with the floating clouds of smoke. Thank God I hated that room. Some changes to the maintenance tunnel. Cool. Mm, CPs that can teleport from waypoint to another. So like 173 can no longer teleport to waypoints next. Thank God. Stairs are... Thank you. Thank you, dear God, that was the one thing I hated about Contamber, just the freaking stairs. Optimization to that way NPCs are animated. FPS doesn't drop as drastically when the MTF spawn anymore, although it's, you know, <laughs> the jumble of spaghetti. That's true, it is pretty much a jumble of spaghetti. Minor bug fix. You know, I have a 1.0.6 glitchy breach video, two of them actually that are coming up in maybe a week or so. <laughs> Trust me. Minor bug fixes aren't enough. Room specific ambient sounds are re enabled, baby. That's gonna make my life easier for XK class. More optimization to the room models. Cool! Now only rooms that are using the generated map fix bug possible. Duplicate items. I wanna know what that bug was. Drop portal from the door. Thank you! 
attack animation doesn't glitch anymore when running away from it, thank god. And the gamma slider works the way it should now, not just increasing brightness. Dang. The Rick. Fixed the bug in security cameras and showed a ton of... <laughs> Failing to load a sound now only displays an error message in the go- THANK YOU! THANK YOU, DEAR MERCIFUL GOD! THANK YOU! I love you so much! The guard now shoots you if you don't go into the containment chamber! Doesn't he already do that? Okay, then. Um, remove the wall blocking away to all 5s chamber and fix it. Thank you. Stay after dropping. Okay. But the night vision goggles are keeping gas mask or wearing. Fix the bug and attendant prevented the event from ending properly. Fix some tissues. Okay. Remove the wall blocking the way to L35's chamber. Fix some bugs in his animation. Fix the bug that caused doorways leading into nothing. Thank you! If you people have been watching my videos, you know I have a problem with that. My, uh, as I call them, the rooms to oblivion. The longer view distance when wearing night vision goggles no longer stays after dropping the goggles. Um, blah, blah, blah. Fix the bug in 1074 from the parenthesis. Okay. Failing to load. Didn't I just read that? Okay, whatever. Vision doesn't turn black when equipping 178 or gas mask. Okay. Now, what I was originally going to do was I was just going to, you know, mess with some of these a little. You know, I am. I don't care what you people say, alright? I don't care what you say. Nail me all you want for this. It has to be done. I'm opening up my mod XK class, which is nowhere near done yet. And it will be a serious mod. Just trust me, uh, it only looks silly. It's gonna be serious, I swear. Okay, I swear, that's all I'm going to change, okay? Alright, so, now we have our game. Let's finally be... Oh, I'm sorry, it's going to harm my computer? Freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me right now? Windows Smart Screen. Fuck you, I am disabling that. Run anyway. Run anyway. Sorry about that. Okay, just going to... Not full screen launcher. There we go. And ladies and gentlemen, we are playing 1.1 at long freaking last. Oh my god, I'm going for the Euclid mode because that looks cool. Options. I'll, I'll do this for YouTube. And we'll hug. I'm mapping. Good. E and crouch is the control. Okay, that's good. You game. Oh, look at this baby. Finally! Enabling difficulty. The game can be saved at any time, however, as in the case of the SCP object, the save quest does not mean that handling it does not pose a threat. Okay. You could. You could class objects are insufficiently understood or inherently unpredictable, such that reliable containment is not always possible. In nuclear difficulty, saving only allowed at specific locations marked by lit up computer screens. Okay. Consider most dangerous ones in Foundation Custom Containment the same you can be said for these this difficulty level more aggressive and you only have one life. When you die, the game is over. Oh, Freaking kidding me, I can make a custom! Baby! I can combine them! Boop. 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 Okay, I've wasted enough of your time. The one hour of playing this game. No, I'm gonna play until I beat it. We're going Euclid difficulty. And I'm playing until we beat it. One episode. Let's do this thing. I am so hyped. Uh, sorry, AGDQ rubbed off on me a bit.
Don't scare me like that, game. So many glitches I want fixed. I don't even care that this game, that this version was ready months ago. You think I care? I don't care. <laughs> Blue Feather, one of my favorite songs. It lasts like two seconds. Reading. I'm the other SCP fan. I'm trying to stop you. I'm going to tell you one more review here. And one of our top secret research facilities. Unfortunately, the exact news of your phone works. Signs are highly classified. Please read. Please be careful. Make sure you're listening. They've got some work for you. Do me a favor and step out of your cell. Just follow me. Oh, by the way, we're authorized to kill any disobedient test subjects, so don't try anything stupid. Doctor L, please report to heavy containment. Wait, Doctor L is okay. See. My God. So, uh, how's it going? Uh, are you talking to me? Hey, who do you think I'm talking to? This guy here with the punchable face? Of course I'm talking to you. Oh, I'm just a little surprised. I think this is the first time you've ever spoken to me. Oh, uh, yeah. It's your first day of working here. Uh, actually, we've been together now for about five months. Really? Wow. That's weird. I love these two guys. My favorite is a tuna caster with them. That kind of discussion. So, J five zero zero five one three seven one four seven eight nine J eight six zero eight nine five nine one four nine three nine nine seven zero ten twenty five 
10, 1048, 1074, 1123, Maynard, the plot unfolds, I like that name, Harp, Hesnav Ultimate, Key Omni, Console, Game, you know I'm going to have to break you now, right? Tesla, thank you, and Pocket Dimension, okay. Alright, so if you don't work, I'm just starting a new game, because I'm not using console commands. Also, I think that 173 glitched through a wall, but then again, I left the door open, so that could have been my fault. If not, then he glitched through a wall. He does that sometimes. He's a bit glitchy. Oh. Oh. to read that I'm going to read that right this second don't think I'm not gonna read that I am okay what one new ones are there okay old 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 one seven eight wait does one four eight have one now no, why does not one four eight not have it Okay, 1123, 1074. Okay, so it's just those three. Nothing new. Oh, and the navigator. Okay, so there's four new loading screens. I'm going to read them all right now. Okay. Standard issue night vision goggles are given to MTF in the event of an electrical blackout. Scientists are also provided with them, but are advised to focus on evacuation and blackout. Okay, then. Interesting. Okay, so let's see. Next is SCP-178 is a pair of white stereoscopic 3D glasses with a rectangular white cardboard frame and lenses of transparent blue and red, left and right lenses respectively. Plastic. The item exhibits no unusual physical properties apart from a single discoloration of the cardboard consistent with age. When worn, the wearer begins perceiving a large bipedal entities in addition to its ordinary surroundings. Entities reportedly exhibit a docile and occasional curious behavior, with one exception. If any attempt by the wearer or any other personnel to directly interact with the entities results in severe lacerations suddenly appearing on the person involved. Okay. I've read him millions of times, I just want to see if he changed anything. 1074 is a portrait-sized oil painting on canvas produced by an unidentified artist. With photographed or videotaped, the entirety of 1074 appears to be painted a uniform shade of gray with distinctly visible brush strokes. When 1074 is viewed by a human being, the observer immediately begins to exhibit psychic physiological symptoms similar to the onset of Stendhal syndrome, including increased heart rate, sweating, and vertigo. The individual wearing uh, and viewing SCP-1074 will attempt to vividly describe the image they are seeing to anyone present, frequently describing it as the greatest and most moving work they have ever seen. You're not even saying the full thing, whatever. The human skull is the left hand of the mom's team. Across the exterior skull and frontal, it's modern, clear script, with human blood translates as a 
Genetic testing confer confirms that both the skull and the blood are from the same individual. The Gamora's script is badly faded and visible to most subjects beyond 5 meter distance. Subjects at 1 meter or less in the object will report the blood being fresh as if still wet, as well as other anomalous sensor phenomena including st smell, sounds, and tactile responses. Okay, so what I've noticed is that uh, Jonas has decided to exclude the very interesting parts about these two in particular. I guess he wants to leave it as a surprise. I can't blame him. I mean, I wouldn't want the surprise room. Okay, so I actually did glitch it. I'm gonna go left this time. Okay. But those computer screens are... Ah, uh, it's not... They're an interesting concept. I like them. Okay, then. I'm not gonna go for the hand, I'm just gonna try to get across. right here, in which case I'll gladly go for it. Yes, no, no. Oh, yes, yes, it's here. Oh, God. oh shut up, you big baby. We all know you're the one who did me. Still the ugly bastard I'm not on my seat. I think that glitch is funny. The rest of them? Show yourself. Hey, who's there? Ah, stay back, you ugly bastard. Oh, that's a new sound effect. I like that. I really like the concept of this new Euclid mode. Don't even have a what's the password? Get out of there. Five eight nine eight. Gotcha. Though I probably will check out the maintenance tunnel just to see how it's changed. That got louder. Here's the deal. I'm gonna go back to the first room to save. Show yourself. This game has gotten. This game, to me, just not only got more challenging, but also infinitely more fun. I'm used to your tricks, you old dog. 
As long as 106 doesn't show up like he sometimes does. Also, I've noticed the two of them. The two of them stop at different points, just so you know. For example, that guy just kept walking the whole way. Quite the trooper. Let me through, please. <laughs> it lets me through all the time. What gives? At least it didn't catch me. Then I'd be really screwed. Probably. It usually lets me through, I wonder why it didn't. I'm gonna head back and save. Because that password is too valuable for me to lose. Like, I'm not even kidding. If I lose this password, I'm gonna be pissed. It's too valuable. Going up the stairs and I don't have to run. <laughs> Voice crack. 10,000. I didn't know my old buddy could show up down here. Can I? Where is he? Well, this is wonderful. I don't know if he's right or left. Password, screw it. And now I literally just said the password was too valuable to lose, but forget it. Glitches! Ooh, this room, this room, this room, this room. Of course I'll be doing the achievement challenge. Why are you even asking that? here the whole freaking time. I guess any computer monitor works. New room in the pocket dimension. I 
I'm heading into the pocket dimension now. I need to see the new... Leaving that room, as far as I'm concerned, not only is it guaranteed to drop you off in the real world, but it's also almost guaranteed to drop you off in the entrance zone. And on top of that, when you get dropped off, your vision will be permanently blurry until you find eye drops. It's the only way to get permanently blurred vision in the game as far as I know. So, in other words, boop, that room. And if my voice sounds a bit funny, sorry, I'm still a little sick. I'll be showing off what that SCP does when I get the key card. So he said, if Jonas said that he would be If he replaced the room with the smoke, then I know how to get there. God damn it. That's why Bill caused the impression, by the way. I don't like that. I still think he's saying that he'd like to kill a man whose name is Eric. And I know a man whose name is Eric. Should be a computer <laughs> Wait, I'm actually not 
So, yeah. Next time I die, I'm just gonna sort of just use the console commands to show off the new stuff. And we've come literally full circle, so I think I'm gonna use that now. The storage room contains a bunch of random goodies, from documents to really anything else. It's random what you get. Okay, we have another one of these. Wait, 096 has a document now? Holy poo! Well, he probably already had one. Oh, I'll, I'll read it later. You probably already had one, you just have to get it through 914. Playing card, playing card. Enough batteries to last a lifetime. 939. 939. Radio. 62 again. Clipboard! Clipboard at long last! You know, just to celebrate the clipboard, I am picking up. Oh. I suggested. Maynard! <sighs> Freaking Maynard! It's not just me, right? You guys hate him too? Also, you can put a key clipboard on very fine and get a super clipboard which has enough room to hold all the documents in the game. Unless they changed it. Hey, I finally get a free 
freaking key card. How about? Oh wait. I think the shortest way out is through the southeast wing. Follow me. Are you gonna glitch through the wall again? Oh, now he decides not to. Thank you for being polite. Okay, what is up with you today? Seriously. Okay, so as far as I'm concerned, these three freaking kidding me. Oh wait. Should I Okay, um I'm going to go and find a monitor. Oh hey. Can I open it with level 2? But you're a safe class object. Hello my baby, hello my honey, hello my baby. Right this way, love. I have a big surprise for you. Right this way, doll. Satisfied every time. By the way, something a little cool. First, well, note to self: if you want to save, you can. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right, but you know, I really want to show off those last few changes. So let me look through them really quickly. Okay, just looking through the matrix. I want to see how the MTF work now. The new room in the pocket dimension. One seven eight. I really want to see one seven eight. And ten seventy four. And the very fine uh, night vision goggles. Okay, so one oh six. Very fine night vision goggles. 178-1074. If that's the case, I should probably just fly right into them, shouldn't I? But after that, I'm gonna end the video here. Okay, baby, where Oh yeah, 
New room time. Let's see this new room. I think it's this. Yep, this way. Aren't you going to command me to kneel? Fine. Oh, hello? What the- where am I? I want to do. I want to wheel. Make it almost there. It's just a floating image. Oh, and everything else despawned. Lovely. Of course, I can't help but look at it, but looking at it makes me bleed. Wait a second. This place is... I know where this is! I know exactly where we are right now. We've been right here all along. <laughs> oh, so it's just above Old Man Larry's room. Regalis, you are a master. Uh, no, sorry, not Regalis. Jonas Rakoman, you are a mastermind beyond comprehension. And you deserve every ounce of praise that you have ever gotten in your life. This is such an ingenious concept. 
Hey, I'm below the planks. Hey, excuse me, I'm below the planks. Thank you. The nerve of some people. No clip back on. Can I just say how much I freaking adore this game? Like, holy crap. Here it is. Where am I? Oh, I'm in the. Oh. 1074. I was right here the whole time. Are you freaking kidding me, game? I see you in there, Mr. Sneaky Sneaky. Serious though, I am in love with this game. Sorry, I'm sick. know about it, you can read it. Euclid wants to have made Cognito Hazard. Is the level 2 enough? Of course not. Wait. Okay. Achievement strings, what? I'll have to look into this later. Room 1123, room 178, room 2 test 1074. That's the name that I'm gonna have to remember. <laughs> Teleport room 1123. Um, sure, why not? I like that. Now that we have saved.
Where are you? The atrocity skull, where are you? By the way, there's sort of a recreation of this room, just no monitor and... Wait, what? This room's supposed to be different. There's supposed to be a thing... What? Where am I? Where am... Oh dear god, I know what this is. Kind of. Oh, the back of the door texture is a computer. I wouldn't have even thought of that. It's a genius. Death message because I thought I was dead. You're supposed to be dead. How are you alive? God. Also, supposedly the medical bay is here too. Why aren't you here? I want to show the good people of the world your properties. Oops. Don't be giving me that look. Do it with God mode off and wearing these puppies. Oh, wait. I don't 
Oh my god. I have a feeling that I have a feeling that uh, the death messages work differently now, so I love that. Cut to guys need to play. Seriously though, that room really freaked me out. Oh, what a beautiful painting! I feel compelled to walk towards it. This work of art is the greatest I've seen in my entire life! What is this supposed to mean? That was a glitch that some text didn't show up. Sorry. Was being Why'd you have to kill me? Come on. I was gonna live while well, I was catatonic. Indefinitely. Okay, so now I'm gonna show up the new FTF AI. They really did fix the rooms to oblivion. I'm impressed. The new AI, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my dear god, this is finally happening! I've waited months to see this. Come on, contain him! Contain him! Contain the sorry bastard. I know you're blinking. Contain the sorry bastard. Yeah, he was right. The spaghetti that is that the spaghetti mess that is their AI. Contain them. Wonderful. <gasps> Did they just say what I thought I see heard them say? Forget about the deep, focus on the statue. Dear God, it's happened. Forget about the deep, focus on the statue. <laughs> Containing what's... 
really. Continue 173 is consistent now. Well, if it'll work. So, are you gonna do anything about it? Forget about the Jeep. Focus on the statue. Start shooting. Contain him. Contain him. Are you gonna be doing this, Frog? And how come when he. Really? So why can he move if they're watching him? Recontaining! Recontaining! You're supposed to say forget about the deep focus on the statue, not forget about the deep linking. You know, somebody should make like a remix of blinking, blink, blink, blinking, blink, 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 blinking, blink, 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 Okay, so I'm just gonna take this radio. Okay. I'll keep in touch. this asshole back to his containment cell. ASAP. Mobile Task Force Unit Epsilon 11. Please take SCP-173 and floating box to his containment cell. Praise the sun. Hallelujah. Eventually they'll take him back to his containment chamber. Then they'll close the door and lock him up. Boo -doo, boo -boo -boo -doo. I'm gonna keep the radio out for when that happens. So are you actually gonna take him? I I'm just a floating guy. I can't do anything about him.
teleport start, teleport start right freaking now. Are they gonna are they gonna do the thing? With the thing? Oh now it's here? What? No, no, you're recontaining, remember? Where, where did you put that guy, anyways? Where is he? Um, where is he? Please tell me you're recontaining. I'm sorry, what are you doing? So where'd you put that statue again? Gotcha. Finally, indeed. Oh, I have been waiting years, literally years, for the day that I could personally recontain 173. Thank God they fixed it. It finally works. Before, it would be like a one in a million chance if they even noticed him or paid attention to him. I think like one or two videos in the internet exist about it. Break the window. This game was also made a bit scarier, I like that. So now that I have 714, I got rid of 714, didn't I? Or better yet, I probably didn't even pick it up. But yeah, you can use 714 to avoid the painting, and then you get an achievement then. So the last thing I wanted to show off was the Atrocity Skull 1123, but... 
I'll start a new save file, but you have no idea how happy I am. Even if it is a little glitched right now, do you think I care? One to seventy three is out of my life for now. He has been fixed, ladies and gentlemen. He has been neutered. Kiss me. Kiss me, fool. Kita Custom. Oh, heh, my bad. This will be the new test file. I swear, I'm like Jonas's personal bug tester. <laughs> That'd be cool, but no, I'm not. That would be the best thing ever if I was Jonas's personal bug tester. Listen to me. 
no matter what happens, after you see this video, you need to look up SCP-1123 immediately. That made no sense to you, but trust me, look up 1123. It will all make sense. Dear God, this is incredible. Is there something here? I can see something big, like a line and a shape. Oh my dear God, I know exactly what that is. I know exactly what this is. I understand what's going on, and I don't like it. Okay, I need a translation stat. Translation, please. That's Russian. I think he said good night. Or maybe it's a different language. I'm permanently crouched. Oh shit. Was I in god mode? No, I wasn't. Permanently crouched now, by the way. Am I in God mode? Okay, I know exactly what that is. But you need to look up SCP-1123. Okay, listen, in the original box of Horrors mod, what would happen is you would go into the room, and occasionally you would be teleported to a different room that was right on top of it, where it's just a bunch of weird symbols, and it's blurry for like two seconds, and then you come back and everything's fine. And touching the skull itself would result in an instant death. That is incredible! That is what actually happens when you touch SCP-1123! Oh my god. And that poor kid. And who was I playing as? Oh, poor kid. Something horrible must have happened to him. I need a freaking translation. That whatever was written that one wasn't Russian. But oh my god, I will see you on the flip side. I love this game.